Hello everybody, welcome back to Starfield. In the last one, I started the game and began my space adventure. You've proven an adequate pilot. Are you familiar with ship combat tactics? Because that's a no. complete Since this game's official release, there have been a lot of opposing and polarizing opinions regarding this game. And I just want to say that so far, I absolutely love this game. And I am very much looking forward to diving in and really experiencing all this game has to offer. So with that, we're going to get right into it. I am mainly focusing on what I assume to be the main storyline, just in the beginning at least, just until I get my footing. So I am teamed up with my partner in crime, Miss Sarah Morgan, and we are outside the UC building following a lead on another artifact piece. So the plan is to march into that building and see what they know. Here we go. I won't lie to you guys, I, I have been watching a lot of Starfield content and I'm really excited to just keep playing this game. I'm really excited to update my ship and just, you know, once you get really into this game, it looks like it is just so Max. much fun. So I am I am really excited Sarah, to keep diving in. Good to see you. Who's your friend? Hopefully constellations new Sarah, he's talking to you. Get over here, girly. Uh, <laughs> Having a conversation like 20 feet hey, apart. You ever think of joining up with a vanguard? Help the United Colonies, earn some credits, even get your UC citizenship? Uh sure. I like how I say I'm focusing on the main storyline and then immediately <laughs> join a faction the first opportunity I get. I would actually love to join the Vanguard. Sign me the hell up. Excellent. Just need to do a little paperwork. An orientation on the UC, and knock out an exam, and a probationary mission. We need to know you'll be able to hack it out there after all. I have to do all do that? Well. What's the job? I'm in! I'm out! I quit! Whose kidneys are these? First things first, head down to the orientation hall. Get signed up at the registration terminal. The system will walk you through the rest. Oh, and if you got a bounty? Well, you're gonna have to make things right with the UC before we'll let you join. Well, if luckily, got any oh, I can get you sorted. Nope, no questions. I just have a lot to talk about. I was gonna say, well, luckily, I really haven't had the time to cause much trouble and garner a bounty, so I guess I'm gonna go get oriented and then take an exam. Silly me, thinking I was gonna go on a space adventure. Nope, we're gonna go take an exam. A space exam. You gonna come with? You gonna wait here, Sarah? I guess we'll see. Oh, Sarah does come with. All right. Oh. <laughs> See, that's that Bethesda charm you just can't get anywhere else, you know? Please select enlistment agreement. Okay. Da, 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 da. You agree to perform necessary services. Da, 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 da. Wait. Up to and including death. Hell yeah. All right, yeah, I lightly skimmed it. I, Lily, agree. Great. Now I get to go explore the orientation hall. Oh, look at this. They got like a little museum. Ah, the end of Earth. Do I want to know about this? In 20 minutes, Sounds sad. Humanity learned the Earth's magnetosphere would collapse sometime in the next half century. Do I have to listen to this or can I just kind of boogie? With all these buttons I have to press. Do I have to listen to all of this? I don't want to listen to all of this. I'm sure it has some real useful information, but I, I don't have time for that. I am not listening to Jeffrey, but he's still talking. I am not listening to you. What the hell is this? You know it was some UC general that condemned Londini? Gave it over to these things. One of these murals said he was executed after the war. Might have gotten one off of my too lightly. Can control control minds. But that can't be true. Oh, so this is a terror morph. Look at that face. My goodness. Why wasn't there a button for that guy? I'm much more interested in whatever the hell's going on with that guy than any of this history. Press. I just like pressing buttons. I don't like hearing what happens after. I'm just here to press buttons, you know? Oh, I think that's it. All right, good museum tour. I definitely paid attention to all of it. Great. I think I got it, but just in case, tell me the whole thing again, I wasn't listening. <gasps> this place is more like a museum than an orientation hall. I feel like I'm just here for a history lesson. Applicant, do the piloting simulation. 
I've spent a fair bit of time in simulators just like these. They're startlingly realistic. Have fun. Oh! I'm doing a simulator! Ah, you must be our new applicant. Yes. I'm Proctor Samuelson. The simulator's already been prepped. You can head in whenever you're ready. Oh, it's a... It's a piloting exam! Great! Your task is to defeat at least three tiers of simulated opponents. Accomplish that and you pass the exam, and can then proceed on to your probationary mission. However, if you defeat more than three tiers of enemies, your required enlistment time for citizenship will be reduced. Well, great. Let's just get right into Good it, hunter. huh? Simulated enemies? That's easy. That's so easy, I'm not even worried about it. This is the Mark 18 Flight Simulation Chamber applicant, currently in orbit around a high-detail recreation of a remote world. Great. When you're ready to begin, please take a seat in the pilot's chair. Way ahead of you, bub. Give me those simulated enemies. Your exam is simple. Defeat as many tiers of opponents as you can before your ship is disabled. You must defeat at least three tiers of opponents to pass the exam. Good hunting, applicant. Yeah, I know you already told me all this. Also, real quick, you can change the perspective in flying. I know that now. Isn't third person just so much better? That's how you do space combat, you know? Oh boy. Wait, is he level 32? Why is he level 32? I'm not level 32. Lock. Quick, lock. I need to hit him with missiles. Oh boy. I like kind of forgot how to play this game. <laughs> it was at this moment that he knew. Get over here, you dirty dog. Come face me like a man. Oh, you do a lot of damage. All targets eliminated. Oh boy. Tier one reached. Initiating tier two. I'm not ready. I'm not ready. I know you have to a lot power and stuff and and there's so many things, and you have lasers and ballistics and missiles, and now there's two enemies! Oh, and the simulated ship smack talk you! What the hell is that? Okay, there's one. Not so bad, not so bad! Here comes number two! Number two is pissed at me. Missile, missile it, for hell's sakes. Oh, there we go, that's what the hell I'm talking about. Ah! This is stressful. This is a stressful little exam. Tier two reached. Initiating tier three. Oh, tier three. Oh boy. What? Three enemies now? There's enemies everywhere. They're mad at me! Oh, boost me out of here. Boost me the hell out of here. I don't want to die. I don't want to fail my exam. I've never failed an exam in my life, and I don't want to start now. Ah! <laughs> Stop it! I know enemies are locking on. How do I avoid them? It's not like I have like a cool spin move or something. That was your maneuver? Moving slightly to the left? Well, I mean, we're not in the same place we were, eh? Oh wait, I can repair my ship? Oh, dude. Well, repair it then. This is a bad test. This is a not fun test that doesn't accurately represent my skills. I can't even boost. I can't do anything. I can like hardly move. I barely have weapons. My ship is screwed! You've been defeated, applicant. You may initiate a reset of your inside the cockpit. Or step outside and take a break. I got screwed. I got robbed, and I got screwed. I'll have you know. I'm pissed! Oh wait, no, like my peg's gonna hit, and I was like, maybe not, and then it was like So dumb. That was dumb. I got shafted, dude! I couldn't even move! Everything was red and flashing at me and everybody was pissed at me for no reason. <laughs> Hi, you guys suck and I hate you. Look at this, where's my maneuverability, huh? Where's my, where's my dodge here? I don't see it. I don't have like a spin move I can do all of a sudden, you know? No, I just have to take it like an idiot. Look at this, what do you, what's a gal supposed to do? Kill him, just kill him, please, 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 please. Okay, there's one. At least I leveled up, I guess. Hey, stop targeting me, dude. Stop it. You know, I can't even see him. It's like, where the hell are you? They're somehow amazing at dodging and I can't dodge at all. Tell the men, it's time to shoot the moon. Shoot the moon! Get 
Back over here! Hit him with the ballistics! Come on! Kill the hell out of him! Ugh! First try! <laughs> Who do you think you are? I am! Just to say I did it, I'll try one more tier, alright? Just to be an overachiever, I'll try one more. But if I die again, I'm out, alright? I did it, and this is just extra credit. Missile him, missile him! Oh, oh, this is already going horribly. I'm chasing them though, so that's nice. I'm actually on the offense for once. Get him with missiles! Kill the hell out of him! Yeah! Alright! Alright! Oh wait, that tier just had one guy? Initiating tier five. Alright! Tier tier five me, baby! Let's let's keep this party going! Why not? I'll go until I die. Tier 46. Ah! There's too many guys! There's too many of them! There's too many of them! I already know I'm gonna die on this one. Don't get your hopes up, folks! Oh, hey! They can destroy freaking asteroids? Did y'all know that? Just kill them. You just gotta kill them one at a time. Even though I'm dying and there's nothing I can do about it because how the hell do you even dodge? You don't! You just take it! Yeah, but you hardly did anything. You just started listing lazily to the left. Oh, everything's red again. I just gotta take one with me. There we go. I took one with me and that's better than nothing. You know? Oh boy. My ship is flailing, you guys. We're absolutely- I I'm dead in the water, you know? Let's see if I can take number two with me, though. Not weapons! Everything's draining! <laughs> okay, I took another one with me. I took another one with me. This is it, though. I'm- I'm dead. Yeah. You know what? Tier 5 ain't even that bad. That's not that bad. I'm gonna take that. I overachieved a little bit, and that's all that really matters at the end of the day. It's just, I'm not good at that, all right? And I accept it. I'm, I'm good at other things in this game. Look what I can do. Congratulations, applicant. You've passed. Thank you. You can head up to Commander Tuwala to receive your final results and your probationary assignment. Woo! Or you're welcome to take another run at the simulation if you'd no. like to try and earn a better score. No, that simulation we'll can, um, kiss my ass. All right, Tuala. Yes. Give me my mission, boy. Well, look who's back. Everything go all right with the exam? Did you have some questions you needed answered first? Yeah, I wrapped up my piloting exam with flying colors, by the way. And they told me to come back here. Ah, so these are your numbers that just came through then. You ready to hear how you did? Yeah. Hit every mural in the orientation hall, huh? A test of preparation and thoroughness. Two traits the Vanguard values highly. I just like pressing Psychological buttons. Psychological results are all within expected levels. The Navy doesn't have room for folks that'll fall apart the first time they're trying to outrun a homing missile. Yeah, I definitely didn't do that. Now, how'd you do against your foes? Really good. Tier four, not too shabby. The techs make us test each level of the sim too. I can tell you that way were some real artificial bastards. Good job putting them away. Thank you. Hell of a job. I might even let you fly me around sometime. I impressed everybody. So then, looking at your results as a whole, and presuming you're successful in completing your probationary mission, you could have your UC citizenship after only... 10 years service. Pretty standard for combat assignments. But your performance in the simulator does mean I can offer a signing bonus. Help convince you to join the cause. So, you want to make this official? Commit yourself to the cause of the colonies? It's a big decision. John, you're not about to have my compatriot here sign some kind of contract that sells you their grandmother five years down the line, are you? Yeah, John. Officer's honor, Sarah. This is honest work for honest credits. So, you ready to do the deed? Yeah, dude, just, I, I'm gonna join everybody I literally can. Like, this isn't that special. Fantastic. <laughs> then just follow me. Oh, we have to go somewhere special for it? Just do it here, dude. Sign me up, give me my credits, and get me on my way. I'd buy that for a dollar. Ah, yes. This courtyard is a much better place to do this. Very scenic. 
Sign me up, boy. What would be right doing this where we couldn't see the stars? Valid now, point. Raise your right hand. The motto of the Vanguard is Supra et Ultra, above and beyond. That is where we serve, beyond the furthest reaches of the United Colonies military, and with honor and duty above reproach. Do you swear to protect and defend the citizens of the United Colonies to the best of your abilities, and to uphold the values of the Vanguard, honor, loyalty, self-reliance, in all your actions as a member of the United Colonies Navy? For sure. For sure. Then let me be the first to officially welcome you to the United Colonies Vanguard. Thanks. Now, only thing High left five. is giving you that probationary <laughs> mission. And what I've got is comms repair. Comms repair. We're trying to refurb an old colony war processing plant on Tau Ceti Two. Sounds like they'd barely gotten set up when their communications died. So, can the people of Tau Ceti Two count on you? I guess. Oh, that's the spirit. It's comms Head repair. Head to the spaceport and talk to Crew Chief Harath. He'll get you the repair suite plus your new recruit kit. Oh, and your advance. Ooh, money. Give it your all out there. Supra et Ultra. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Supra et Subaru. Right back at you, dude. 4,800 credits? Hell yeah, dude. That's what the hell I'm talking about. Did you see that boost pack save? Yeah, I'm a pro gamer. That was legitness. Yeah, it was. Ah, you are new probationary then? Yeah. Crew Chief Herat. Pleasure to be working with you. So, paying a visit to the people of Scenic Tau City 2. Nice easy one for your first job. Just keep your head on swivel and you'll come home safe. Any questions before you head out? No, but the fact that everybody keeps calling it an easy mission makes me think this isn't going to be an easy mission. What's going to go wrong? My gamer senses are tingling, dude. Make us look good out there, recruit. Yeah, 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 yeah. Now I just get to sprint to my ship. I finally get to go to space. Oh, interesting. So if you sprint too much... CO2 will start to build up. I don't want any carbon dioxide. Just oxygen for me, please. Cake or death? Uh, cake, please. Anyways, <laughs> let's get the hell over to Tau Ceti 2, huh? Coming in hot to save your comms. I'm gonna repair them and nothing else is gonna go wrong. I do wish, like, there was more of a gameplay transition between being in space and being on a planet. Like, I wish you could, like, almost land a little bit. But maybe we'll get that in an update. For now, I'm satisfied. How could you be mad at this game? An abandoned meat packing facility built on the fringes of the She's talking that way. She's not even looking at me. I don't know. Let's find out what happened, huh, Sarah? Oh, what? You don't like it when I'm that close to you? <laughs> she likes her personal space. She likes to talk to you, not facing you, and she also likes her personal space. And let me tell you, I care about my personal space. Whoa, whoa, hey, who's around me right now? Anyways, something went wrong, right? Yeah, look, there's a guy dead on the ground. And claw marks! Oh, oh, I'm starting to see a picture here, folks. I'm not gonna say anything yet, but I have an idea as to what's going on. I wonder what happened. Something's I know been Sarah here recently, but left everything in place. <laughs> At least we know it wasn't the Crimson Fleet. Almost like it was some sort of horrible monster we saw in a museum a few minutes ago, huh? Huh? Keep away from my personal space. I'm betting it's a terramorph. I I'd put money on it, I think. The foreshadowing just lines up too perfectly, you know? I think. I think I'm right on the money, baby. Either I got hit harder than I thought, or you've got some incredible. A lone survivor! I think it knows you're here. I'll unlock the door. Second floor, main building. But be quiet. Yeah, I'll be quiet. That would have been better if my gun was reloaded. Yeah, I'll be quiet. Really subtle. For sure, dude. I won't draw attention to myself. What do we got here? It's too clean to be one of the settlers. Or a pirate. You see on patrol, maybe? Yeah, make my day if you said you were a shock trooper out for a stroll. Your shock trooper is here to save the day! <laughs> of course you are. 
My hero. I'm Hadrian. I'm a... I was a researcher with the UC. I, I came here on a rumor of a... Well, I expect you saw the results on your Terra way in. Terra Morph. What's Terra Morph. left of the settlers? Terra the Morph. The work of Oxisio Machina. A Terra Morph. Boom. One of the Boom. nastiest aliens humanity's Boom. ever crossed paths with. And this one, well, it's something of an anomaly. Possibly a worrying one. All right, cool. Well, it sounds like you could use my help then. <laughs> I sure could. Because to confirm my suspicions about this creature, I'm going to need a tissue sample from it. And to get that, I need its corpse. Word. But there is a way we can give ourselves an edge against this thing. The plant's security system. The admin terminal's here in this building, but it needs its connection reset. Mm -hmm. And as I found out, that's not a one-person job. Of course. But if you can make it to the security outpost and restore the connection, I think I can get things back online. See if the settlers left us any other tools. Man, it's so hard being right all the time. Let's get into it. Let's fight that alien. Good. Once I see the connection reset, I'll get things underway on my end. Take care of yourself out there. Right and back sure at you. Need enough of that thing for us to get a sample. I'm gonna make it into ground meat, lady. After I loot this place, of course. Yoink, yoink. Oh, yoink. Don't mind if I do. I love stealing. I love taking things. All right, so we have to get a security system back up online. I assume it's gonna kind of be like an alien isolation situation where there's a big, huge Hulk and alien after me and I have to sneak around and be very stealthy or else I'll get my head ripped off. But I, I'm fine with that, you know? That's old hat to me. Not my first rodeo, baby. What's this? Expert? I'm not an expert. Master? Dude! Oh, loot I can't get. That makes me want to cry, honestly. When there's loot I can't get, it just... It really pisses me off, because I want that loot. I'm going to make a point to come back here someday and unlock those crates. Just you watch. You mark my words. I'll be back. And press. Um, status. What's your status? Reset that status, boy. Tracking system offline. Well, that seems like that would be useful. Connection restored. How do I get that I back way. up? Hmm. Plants turrets took a beating, but I should be able to get you a couple of kill lanes. Just get the thing to chase you down the alleys between the buildings, and you'll lead it right into a crossfire. I'm sure they had something. They Hello. Use. I wish I'd found this earlier. You notice those sensors around the facility? Part nope. of the livestock tracking system. Should let you keep tabs on how close the Terramorph is. That's what I'm talking about. Turn on tracking system. Well then tune it, you know? There we go. Where is it? Right in front of me? Tracker's reading green. What is that sound? Stop. Stop whatever you're doing and get in cover. It's on the move. Where though? Oh! Oh, yep. There it is. It didn't even eat it. It just okay. killed it for fun. I engage directly if you can avoid it. The kill lanes. They're set up but need power. There's breakers on each of the buildings you can throw to get them live. Once they're online, lead the Terramorph towards the lights and watch the fireworks. You can do Yay! This. Show it it messed with the wrong shock trooper. I regret lying now. I'm not a shock trooper. I'm just some lady. All right, flip that one. Bada bing, bada boom. One down, two to go. That's fine. You know, we got one 20 meters away. And one 40 meters away. That's that's a cakewalk. It is staying away. Not to jinx myself immediately, but it is staying away from me, at least. I'd like to see it though. I'd like to get as close to it as possible without dying. I think. Okay. And ba bam. Not even worried about it. I flipped two buttons. Why is it just one out of three? Was the first one just for fun? What the hell is even that? I want to see it. 
I want to, but I don't want to, you know? Like, where the hell could it be? Oh, we're getting closer to it. Seeing a meat packing facility from the inside. Oh, Sarah, you scared me. me feel like I should switch to becoming a vegetarian. Suck it up. You're gonna see a lot of blood and gore and viscera if you're gonna be my companion. And a flip. What if I just... Did that get anybody's attention? I would like to see a Terramorph at some point, you know? This big baddie ain't such a big baddie. Where is it? It's a miracle we were able to bring that thing down. At least we avenged the deaths at the colony. What? I killed it? I didn't do anything! Okay, well that's great and all. And I will quick save, but I would like to reload a little bit and see if I could get myself a glimpse of that bad boy, you know? I would like to see it. Hello, Mr. Terramorph, where are you? I would like to see you, come on. He's being a little coward, you know? My reputation precedes me. Show me the monster, show me the monster, show me the monster. Where is the monster? I'd like to see the monster. It's 23 meters away. I'm standing here. Where is it? Nowhere to be seen. What about, what if I do like one of those? Oh, I was going to try to throw it. That didn't really work. Where is it? Give me the monster. Give me the monster. 53 meters away. Oh my hell. Let's go already. Seeing a meat packing facility. I know, you want to go vegetarian. Shut up and do it. How about? What is this? Oh, it's an Igliosaurus, dude? No way. With a bunch of eyes. It's got the eye situation. Oh, oh. Give me the monster. Give me the monster. Oh, there's the monster. Hello. Get down here. Face me. Oh, it's tough. It's tough. It's tough. It's tough! <laughs> this is what I'm talking about. This is what I wanted. Woo! Oh, hell yeah. Hell yeah! Oh, yes. 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 No, it wasn't. It was really easy, Sarah. They're stupid that they died to this thing. I was begging for it, and it didn't even see me until the very end. Terramore sample cell, bump, well alien genetic material, more tissues, adhesive, and metabolic agent. <laughs> Woo! Did you see that, Hadrian? Did you see me absolutely crush it? I killed the hell out of that thing, and it wasn't even scary. Hell yeah, man. Congratulations, That's amazing. Tracker's gone quiet. I suspect it's either hiding No, it's or dead. It's dead on the ground. Wait. You did it, didn't you? Heavens above, you just flatlined a terror more. It was easy. All right. I spotted a microscope downstairs. Let's see if we can't get to the bottom of this. Well, go ahead. The way is clear. It's clear and safe, I'll have you know. This equipment, it's not set up to do a proper analysis of our sample. But this terramorph being here, of all places, it doesn't make sense. Humanity's spread plenty of creatures in our travels across the stars. Pets, livestock, pests. But terramorphs are different. And scary, apparently. To our knowledge, no one's ever spread them intentionally. Yet somehow, they follow us. I need Dr. Percival Walker to put together a sample analysis for this thing. Full workup. He'll know what that means. I'm not sure exactly where to find him, but last I heard, he was contracting with the Trade Authority on Mars. Mars? There's a place called the Sixth Circle in Sidonia. A bar run by some old friends. I'll meet you and Percival there. Ooh. And here, it's not a lot, but you've definitely earned it. Should cover the cost of fuel to Mars, at least. Buddy! Now please, yes. go do what you have to do to get that sample in the right hands. We need to know what we're dealing with here. Sweet, dude. A thousand more credits. I'm rolling in it. I'm rolling in it. 
So that was a fun first mission for me, huh? Can't wait to go back to the UC and tell him I killed a terror morph. Captain, which I guess is really where are we headed next. Shut up. You know where we're headed. Just let me do it. I guess killing a terror morph is a big deal to these people, but it literally could not have been easier. So let's go tell everybody about it so they can praise me and I can feel good about my skills. Give me compliments. I said I give me compliments. All right, Tuwala. Guess what I did? You're gonna be really impressed, I think. Look who's back. All set with that probationary mission? We can do your debrief and formally welcome you into the Vanguard whenever you're ready. Hold on to your hat for this one. I need your permission to deliver a Terramorph tissue sample to Mars. I don't need your permission, but I'm telling you as a courtesy. A Terror? What? Yeah. How did you walk away with the Terramorph tissue sample running comms repairs? What happened to the settlers? Dead. All dead. On the ground. Cut! 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 No survivors, sir. All lost to a Terramorph. Which I killed. You killed a Terramorph? Yes. On your first mission? Yes. If I could be frank for a moment, holy shit. Yes. Above and Beyond doesn't really begin to describe it now, does it? It was so easy. Some serious hazard pay on this one. But uh, if none of the settlers made it, who's got you delivering the sample? One settler made it, all right? And she gave me this jean tag to show you. I see. This uh, has been one of the more surprising debriefs I've ever been a part of. I did actually have another mission lined up for you, supporting UC system defense against the Crimson Fleet. Boring! Now I guess you have two options on how to proceed. Head to the UC Vigilance and help out SysDef, or deliver that sample. I'm gonna deliver that sample, I'll make sure dude. you've got the proper clearances for either path. I just wanna go to Mars. Consider these I wanna your go to Mars and do space orders. pirate stuff. Now, if there wasn't anything else, I'd suggest you move out. Sir, yes sir, I'm moving out. And I leveled up, that's what the hell I'm talking about. I like it! All right, folks, well that didn't go where I thought it was gonna go at all. Very exciting, very fun. Like I said, I'm just falling more and more in love with this game the more I play it. Looks like next time we're headed to Mars, we're gonna do some space pirate stuff. Because honestly, in my first video, one of you guys commented about being a space pirate in this game, and that's all I've been able to think about ever since I read that comment. So that's what I wanna do. That's what we're going to do, and we'll try it out next time when we go to Mars. Anyways, thank you all so very much for watching and coming on this adventure with me, and I will see you next time.